Hello guys, so welcome to KO Tutorials. So let's continue with the next part of this tutorial. So let's get started. So as you can see over here, we have almost started with the modeling of this particular car in 3ds Max. So let's continue it. So now what I'll be doing over here is like, let's go out of this nubs toggle view over here. Let's go into this. And now what I'll be doing over here is like, I'll slightly select this and I'll extrude it up over here. So press shift and extrude it. Select this, right click and I'll just target weld this. I'll just target weld this. So we have to go in this way. Now, so we have to manage this uh, correctly. So let's again go over here. Select the edge. Let's select the edge over here, shift and drag, right click target weld. <coughs> so we can just shuffle it over here slightly from the top view. Again select this edges, shift and drag. So now, as you can see, we have to manage this correctly over here. Now, what I can do over here is like, now, once done, again select this, push it up over here, select the vertices weld it slightly push it over here shuffle it so as you can see we can try to manage this so let's again go over here let's go to the top view let's just extrude this slightly shuffle it over here go into the top view in this way so we have to manage it correctly over here so let's again select this again extrude it weld it push this up select this again extrude it Shuffle this over here. Shuffle this over here. So, right click, target weld. So again go over here and if you want I can just extrude this down, select this, extrude it over here. Let's put one swift loop over here. So we can just put one swift loop over here. Let's again make the changes over here. So now, shuffle this, if you want you can just go over here, target weld with this in this way. So before we do the target weld stuff, I'll just shuffle this over here. Uh, let's just target weld this. Select this both. Weld it. 
in this city. So we need to adjust it correctly. So so I'll just place it over here, push it over here, weld it. Again select this edges, extrude it. In this way, shuffle it up, push this up, select this, weld it, weld it in this way. So, as you can see now, we are going to work in this way. So, let's just save the file once. So, we have to follow this stuff over here correctly all right so select this edge again extrude it again drag it over here so let's go into the side view and slightly just push it down in this way so we have to manage this stuff correctly so again select this edges shuffle it over here weld it Again, select this edges, weld it, weld it again. So we can do this stuff. So this is a bit tricky part. So you need to take care of it that you are correctly matching the references. That's very important. So go with that you just match the references correctly so you have to do that again select this go over here oops Again, select this edges, scale it from the top, so you can just push this down and this way. So the same way, this is going to go in that, the same profile, so let's just again extrude it in the same right click and let's weld it over here in this way <coughs> so we are correctly matching this as you can see so I can show you, we can just put a <coughs> symmetry modifier. So let's go into this. Let's go into this and let's add a symmetry modifier. And go into this, off this, flip option. So, 
so we can slightly just shuffle it a bit inside so we can get the correct idea so let's just on this so as you can see so we have you can see this now again come out of this knob stopple so you can just off the knob stopple option if you want i can just delete this so that would be much easier for me to work again i'll go over here i'll just adjust this so before you go with this select the vertices and let's target weld it over here right click and just weld it again select the edge drag it down weld it so make sure you are pushing the stuff inside and you are trying to manage it correctly over here so it doesn't give you a problem over here as you can see so let's go to the top view and you can see that the reference should be correctly matched that's important we can just uh, create this over here later the glass part is there on the on the back side over here that can be modeled later also so again i'll come out of this knob stopple let's again go over here and let's again extrude it down let's again weld this adjust it correctly in this way so now again again select this edges let's push it over here go over here in this way weld it select this again select this edges again drag it over here correctly weld it and if you want you can just push it out if needed i can just shuffle it over here in this way all right so guys if any doubts please put it in the comment section over here so please like and subscribe my youtube channel so we'll continue the rest of the part in the coming tutorial so thanks for watching this tutorial